Hey folks, this is Alex the eBay guy here at Beckley's RVs in Thermont, Maryland, and today we have a Sunline Solaris 257SR. This is in fantastic shape. Uh, for those not familiar with Sunline, uh, they were a great manufacturer. Uh, they made pretty lightweight trailers. Um, they went out of business during the mortgage crisis in 08. And they didn't really go out of business because the same reason most of the manufacturers did. Uh, the reason why they went out of business was they refused to cut corners and make things cheaper just to save the dollar. You'll see that when we look at the quality of the cabinets and everything inside. Um, the previous owners of this, it didn't get used much and it didn't get abused at all. They did a lot of maintenance on this. They kept it in good shape. Uh, it's got uh, new tires in 2020. Uh, they added a battery disconnect up front. They kept up with the caulk on it, made it watertight. Um, there's really no um, uh, condition issues on the outside walls at all. Um, there, right inside the door, there's a little soft spot we'll take a look at in just a second. Um, they just put a board over it, which is all you really need to do. That's right here. Um, they just put a piece of that decking board over it. And it's really not. It's soft right here. And this is firm. But as long as you keep the seal here good, you're good to go. Um, they went over it with caulk. I, I double checked to make sure it's in, it's in good shape. That's a piece of leaf there. Um, but it, I went over it and it looks, uh, looks like they did a pretty decent job. It's got a full length awning on the camper. And the cloth looks in decent shape. Let's take a look inside here. One thing you'll notice is it just doesn't have much wear on it at all. They kept the refrigerator open as it should so you don't get any mildew smells or musty smells in it. Freezer, nice white plastic, gets cold just like it should, no foul smells. I don't think they ever use the stove. Check out the burner there, you'll see there's no carbon spots or anything on it, nor the oven. Countertop, really nice shape, no burn marks, really no scuff marks. Same with the sink, got a little use on this side, virtually none on that side. Cloth is all in excellent shape. Same with the cloth and the seating here. And here's what I was talking about the cabinets. These are solid hardwood. These are not vinyl wrap. This is solid wood. And you can hear that when the door shut. We got mirror um, glass in wood over here on this one. And there's a lot of storage. Look at all the pantry space you got up there for pots and pans and all your kitchen stuff. Underneath the uh, refrigerator there. And then check this out. Right over here, we've got this nice slide out pantry for all your canned and dry goods. And there's even some room back behind there where you can store stuff if you wanted to. Floor solid, walls are solid, ceiling solid. One of the places you see a lot of leaks in campers when they're not maintained properly is this skylight right over the bathroom here. There's no signs of water at all. Uh, they've upgraded the door to the modern style self-squeegeeing uh, vinyl door. Got a lot of foot room here in the, in the bathroom. Upgraded to a porcelain toilet. Clean sink. Got a nice deep medicine cabinet. There, by the way, are all the weights for the trailer. I'll put a copy of that in the picture section, or you can pause it and zoom in there. you got a diffused window here in the bathroom. You'll step in here to the bedroom, and notice you've got plenty of room to walk around. Plus, you've got an egress door here in the bedroom. All that storage around the bed. All the walls and corners are nice and solid. Uh, furnace is up on the wall and not in the floor. So your dog hair or pet hair won't get down in there. Air conditioner is blowing nice and cool. It's about 90 degrees today and it's only been plugged in maybe 20 minutes and it's nice and cool in here already. Got a little ledge for the television. 
So this is a Sunline Solaris 257 here at Beckley's RVs in Thurmont, Maryland. I said this is Alex, the eBay guy. If you have any questions, give me a call, 240-405-7790.